Alluring alliteration and amazing assonance. Spice up your descriptions. Hello, language learners. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're going to delve into some exciting language techniques that can really enhance your English skills. We're talking about alliteration and assonance. These two tools are not just for poets. They can make your everyday conversation more interesting and descriptive. Let's start with defining these terms. Alliteration is the repetition of the same initial letter or sound in a series of words. Think about, she sells seashells by the seashore. Hear how the S sound is repeated. Now, assonance is the repetition of vowel sounds in a phrase or sentence. It doesn't have to be at the beginning of the words. An example could be, the rain in Spain stays mainly in the plain. Notice how the I sound is repeated. How can we use alliteration in conversation? Well, it's not just about tongue twisters. Alliteration can make your language more memorable and engaging. For instance, instead of saying, I saw a bird in a tree, you could say, I spotted a sparrow in the spruce. Notice how the S sound is repeated. That's alliteration. Or instead of saying, I need a break. Try, I crave a cup of calming chamomile. Isn't that more descriptive and intriguing? How about assonance? This can also add rhythm and flow to your speech. When you repeat vowel sounds, your phrases can become more musical. For instance, instead of saying, I'm so tired, try saying, I'm beat and in need of a deep sleep. Can you hear the repetition of the EE -E sound? Or instead of, I'm hungry, you could say, I could munch a bunch of brunch. Notice how the a uh sound is repeated in munch, bunch, and brunch. That's assonance. There you have it, language enthusiasts. By sprinkling your conversation with alliteration and assonance, you can create more vivid, musical, and engaging descriptions. Remember, language is not just about conveying information, it's also about creating emotions and painting pictures with words. So go ahead and experiment with these techniques in your daily conversations. Have fun with it! We hope you found this video helpful. Stay tuned for more language learning tips and techniques. Happy learning!